Hello darlings, I am Cassandra. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for coming. You might be wondering, why are we talking about a protection spray and videos about how to be successful? Because I'm gonna tell you something. When you are working on your dreams, you are never more vulnerable to energies and people who are jealous of you, people who don't want you to succeed. But what I have learned about people is not so much that they don't want you to see to succeed. It's just that they don't want to feel like they're being left behind. And sometimes when you are on grind and you're shining and you're doing your thing, people, um, it, it, it causes them to look at their own life and feel like they're lacking. And so you have this energy around you of people who all of a sudden they want to hang out. All of a sudden they want to call you and talk to you for three hours about some problem when you were just about to study, just about to make that video. I am telling you, it's almost like, you know, as you are moving forward there's also a force that's trying to keep you exactly where you are because you got to remember there's a lot of energy around where you are you've created friends you've created you know there's the there's a space that every where everything is thriving because you are there does that make sense and when you leave that space has to be filled with someone else so people Sometimes I think we use the term jealousy for lack of a better term, but people really just, they want you to stay with them. They don't want to hear about, you know, you wanting to get a better job or earn more money or, because now it's like, well, what are you trying to say? I'm there. I'm there thinking, what are you trying to say? I'm not good enough or you don't want to be around us anymore. So you have to be really careful. And this is why protecting yourself is so important. So after you work on your wisdom area, and I also I completed a video on that, so you can click the link over here uh, about wisdom. The next thing I want you to do is really work on protecting yourself and to keep yourself protected. So you want to clear the space when you go into like a new like a hotel or Airbnb or um, if you're any place where you can actually spray or if you can't spray make sure you wear the oil um, if you have company at your house when they leave make sure you sage or make sure you use the white copal but you make sure you cleanse that energy and then you should have at least one day a week where you habitually cleanse the vibrations of the energy in your home so let's just say you pick a Wednesday or a Saturday or whatever day you choose but try to do it at least once once a week I'm not always that good at it I let things build up <laughs> and maybe and sometimes I'm a little bit more organized than others and I can really keep up but once a week is really an ideal situation but also, I just want to tell you, when you're on the journey to your dreams, you want to cleanse your space, cleanse the vibrations in your area so that you can clear the energy field so that you will feel more inspired to move forward towards your dreams. Sometimes you may think, well, I'm just lazy or I just can't stop. I don't know what's wrong with me. You'll be surprised at the the energy in your home, the energy of your friends and family, the energy in your neighborhood. You're in an energy that has, um, you know, taken, has rooted you to the, where you are. Like, you know how sometimes you move, like you go to somebody's home and everybody's home has an energy. Every, every building has an energy. And the minute you walk in there, you can feel it. Like sometimes you walk into a building and you say, oh my God, it feels so good in here right because it does because that's that's the frequency where it's vibrating so when you are trying to accomplish something that really matters to you it is essential do you understand me the wisdom and protecting yourself those two are like the cornerstones to the journey to your success i'm telling you that if you do not protect yourself there are going to be so many i don't want to say forces energies entities people who are moving against you but yeah mm -hmm. 
you it is very it is essential that you keep your energy space clean in this video I am going to go over some tools that you need to protect yourself with yes we're going to protect ourselves so I've done a few videos of some things of, about some things you may need on your journey to your dreams first we talked about wisdom and then I think I gave you an idea for you know I shared a book with you with a lot of you know some really good stuff for protection and wisdom but there are also some practical things that you can use to protect yourself and um, I know people have sage sage is pretty common but also there's a protection candle that I use by Coventry Candles. This uh, protection candle is the bomb, okay? This is a really, really good candle. Um, also, uncrossing spray. Now, when I go to a hotel, I like to spray the room, the room first with the uncrossing spray and spray my bed, you know, get rid of the energy of the previous or anybody who's been in there. Uh, let's see, can I get this in focus? Oh, here we go. This uncrossing spray. This is really good. And then after I spray the uncrossing spray, I like to spray the house blessing spray. Then I have one with peace and bless. This is a really good combination. So I keep, I keep these in my purse. Like I literally, like even when I'm when I've been away from my office, when I come in, I'll spray this and then I will spray this as well to keep the energy clear. Now, one of the things that I totally suggest, this is the best cleanser. Vibra it's like, it's supposed to raise your vibration, clear the energy. Like sometimes I hear like, um, not lately though, like music, like from the 1940s, like a really faint music, or there was like, you know, I could just sense there were, you know, ent entities or spirits in my house. But when I use this, this, nothing to me, sage, nothing I've ever used work as well as white copal. So if you, listen, if you are having some problems in your home or if you're, you know, going to a new, like, hotel or to a new, you know, what do you call them, those, you're staying somewhere new or what is it, Airbnb, whatever. Burn some of this in your cauldron. So what you want to do, because in, in the last video, I think I went over, um, I'm just going to show you what this looks like. Oh, this is a beautiful piece. Oh, I love this brand. It burns so nice and it smells so good. Oh. So this is white copal. And so far, I've had just a really good experience with them. And this is the cauldron that I just right here and it has a little disc in it and you just put it on top just like that and it just oh god whoo smells so good it smells good and you can feel the crispness of the air like it really cleanses the energy it raises the vibration it chills you out listen if you had to choose because this is just my experience i'm just gonna say I like the sage because you know I'm used to saging and that's you know I love sage but this to me is the best best um, cleanser space cleanser that I have personally ever used and this the um, house blessing the spray smells so good oh my god it smells so good it does bring a really good vibration you can just tell because you know like you'll notice that the people in, the, in your home conversation will be lighter and people will be laughing and everyone will feel good this uncrossing spray the reason is really good for your office or any hotel or Airbnb or any place that you stay this uncrossing spray is good you can keep it in your purse like even if you're like getting a child if I was getting in an uber or lyft I don't care it, it is these are really good and I think they work best in like temporary situations but when you have like if you're going to stay someplace for a while and it's okay to burn make sure you use the white cold yeah you're gonna, you're gonna love it you are going to love this white couple you hear me the white couple i love it i absolutely love it so um 
Also, I have some oils. I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you my oils in just a second. So I also have an oil, it's called Fiery Wall of Protection. Let's see, can we get it in focus here? Fiery Wall of Protection, this is a very good oil to protect you, especially like if you're working and there are people who like, you know, gossiping and there's some good candles for them as well. <laughs> but also there's a Fiery Wall of Protection Spray. So, you can get this to protect yourself with as well. I love this spray that's in my office, Joe. This is really good for you. I mean, well, I'm not gonna say this is good for you. I'm just gonna, <laughs> I'm just gonna say I'm sleeping, okay? The Fiery Wall Protection Spray, the Fiery Wall Protection Oil, and there's the Fiery Wall Protection Candle by Coventry Candles. I'm gonna put a picture in this video. Here are the picture, yeah, this th that candle, fire. Yes, darling. And um, so these are some good, yeah, these are some good things to protect you. So um, yeah, I have the links in my description box for all the items I've just showed you, child. So now if you've worked on your wisdom area, you have a good magic book, and now you're protecting yourself. Work on your wisdom area first. Because that'll help you figure out which product is probably best for you and try different things but all of it I have found them to really I'm only talking about my own experience right now may your life be saturated in peace love and joy and may all your dreams come true until next time